Y'all, what's up? What's up? I haven't been here in a minute. Um, before I get into my next vlog, uh, where we tried fishing for carp at the nuclear power plant on Lake Ontario, uh, where we went for carp and didn't ended up catching only one, which is weird. Um, but because I think a lot of the uh, the water was so muddy and there's all these other species there and they were taking away our carp baits, and then we ended up catching. There's other species non-stop all day long and we ended up getting a monster. Um, so it's kind of an interesting, we kind of took what was given. Twig, baby. T-W-I-G, take what is given. And we did take these because I've never seen them give so much. It was crazy, it was one after another. Uh, but yeah, we didn't put every fish in there, but we put just a highlight of a few and a real big one, man, wow. Uh, before we get into that, um really cool stuff i got a package from you know who um uncut angling uncut angling there we go uncut angling uh he texts me saying i gotta send you a contract for these new um this new a few new upcoming projects we got going on and i'm just like so excited to do it i'm like okay send it i'll sign it whatever you need um I open up the package and what do i get it's not a contract it's a jersey so um as my favorite player sean kemp if you don't know who he is search him up uh they call him the rain man because he rains dunks on people and he's a bit weird i don't know um but he's insane he's insane check him out he goes hard in the paint and i referred to him in one of the uncut angling videos or collabos we did in the past and uh, i guess that's why aw remembered it and sent it to me i don't even know how he caught that but the guy's a genius, he's smart, you know that guy, he's weird. And weird is good, and he accepts me for who I am, and I accept him for who he is. And uh, I think that's why we get along so well. And, uh, you know, when you're that close and know each other, I guess a contract is just a jersey. And so AW, I'll sign the contract, here you go, TM, boom, boom, contract signed. Uh, day ones, you know what I mean? We don't need the lawyers, I guess, you know? We're brothers like that. So, uh, yeah, look for some exciting things coming up. And, uh, man, check out this, uh, latest vlog. Not the highest of quality as always, but you know what I mean? It's real. So check it out. Time for us to kick some new flavor on the boat. Come on with Jack the Mac. We're out here on Lake Ontario early in the morning yeah. and we're going after some carp. Do you want to get some carp today? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> As you can see, our carp mission's failing. We got chocolate milk water, big wind, worms, corns, carp baits galore, and no carp. But this is like catfish number 20 something. Right? Yeah. <laughs> it's a funny. big one. And it's a big one. Or is it a carp? What if it's a giant carp? Oh. Good stuff. Jack the Mac. Let's get her going. Beautiful, Deborah. Ooh. That's probably a dirty dangler. Oh my, you're loving it. Another small one, two, three pounds. <laughs> Missed one that just before this it was a little bit better. And this one's small, which is coming in like nothing, right? Yeah. Not another big one, like it didn't come in just like that. Average Joe, you uh, need a fresh head. Smaller than average. Smaller than average, yeah. All we're doing is hooking it through the skin a bit. Help. And these are hair roots. We're using them for carp, and then we just switched over and kept using them anyway. Yeah. It's taking little slabs, eh? I was taking steaks like that. I like the steaks. And the jack's going with these little flappies. Good for the current. It doesn't spin. Kind of swimming, swimming stuff, eh? Huh? Flappies. How many flappies? Three? Four? Oh, he's going big. He's going big flappy. Quadruple flappy. Oh, just don't want to lose this one. Get it through the skin. Because it's all meat. That's good. Four flaps. Yeah, go for this, it. If I get a big fish, it's different than salmon. Yeah. This piece, if I get a big fish, then land them, they lose this piece. I don't want to lose it. It's okay, you got lots. No, it's the only piece. Oh, yeah? That's a good, that's a sweet meat. 
I think this cat has got some sexual candy got going on for itself. It's going to be big. Big, big mama. Way bigger than the last one, the 78 pounder. Sure. Guaranteed. Guaranteed it. Oh, see that carp jump? Yes. That's what we want, but we can't catch it. Small. <laughs> see bigger carp. This could be a this could be cat daddy bro. This is on the white bass that we bought from the market. Oh. We use the Jack says the head, the sturgeon master says, use the head. Is and the lion is still going. Oh, he's bigger fish on the head? Yeah. Are you saying? The lion still going. Still going? Yeah. Uh oh, this is a good sign? Yeah, it's a really good sign. He's still a really going. good bottom, going. bottom going. fisherman, this guy. The bottom master. It wasn't the golden reel, it was the original. Hashik. Oh, yeah. Uh oh, this is big, bro. Do I need to follow it? This is a big fish, hey? Yeah. You called it. On the head. Yeah. Oh my lord. Look at this. Chopping up bait here, man. I thought they were on the stake. He says just leave the head. I catch nine foot sturgeon on head. Yeah, nine feet? Yeah. The sturgeon prince of Vancouver, right here. There he is. Some Jack the Mac. Oh, your camera for carp, and it turned into a flurry of catfish. I've never seen so many catfish catching lots of smaller ones on what worm, yeah. corn, and minnow pieces. But we got lucky here. We're getting some big cats since we went to the old meat. Here we are, still fighting this thing. It's been a while, eh? Well, I had to redo it. It's like 10 minutes in now. Me too. Very happy. I'd rather a cat. Sturgeon. Sturgeon, my first sturgeon. Oh, it's a cat. Yeah. Or is it a brown? <laughs> oh, the tail looks I don't want to leave my phone in the drink, bro. Oh, look at the power in that tail. Oh! <laughs> Jack the Mac, it's a good one, man. Yeah. Oh, Do you have big cats like this in Vancouver? This could be your biggest cat ever. I know it ain't a curve, Jack, but it's good. Yeah. We'll take it, eh? It's a giant. And it bit the hood. That's sick, bro. I'm so happy for you. Look that up, man. Show the viewers. This thing's fat, man. Look at that. Ooh, what a dirty dangler. Red? You saw red? Maybe. Could be our first carp. What well, we're looking for, our target species. First one on the old tuberama. Threw against the shoreline and whammo. Weird, I know, it's out of the box. It seems weird, but yeah, get a lot of. Big carp too. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yes. Yep. It's a yes. carp. Yes. Yep, he hammered it too. It's right in the mouth. Yeah. Yeah. We did it. <laughs> it's a nice one too, eh? Bigger than the last one, yeah. Yeah. Maybe over ten pounds? Yeah, easy. Easy. It's bigger than you think, it's very thick. Yeah, we got him. <laughs> Number yeah, one. Uh, oh, finally, buddy. <laughs> How's it feel? Nice. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Just hammered it. Right. And it right? <laughs> Using all the carp baits in the world, not a touch. Go to a bass bait, typically, and then whammo. Like, I've been getting these big carp on soft plastic for years, but, you know, I never think to, like, it would be better. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> so far it's better.